when you have 3,000, 3,000 public school kids learning to row on herbs, learning the language of rowing, that is powerful. Rowing programs for the first time are inspiring cultural change within an Olympic sport. And they're doing that by introducing youth and adults, people with physical disabilities, to a sport that before they didn't think was accessible to them. is an indoor rowing program that came to our school and an ERG is a rowing machine that you can use and it feels like you're rowing on water. ERG Ed program is a program that helps kids to get more to become more familiar with rowing and to practice rowing skills. I learned that it was very hard but it looked easy and it was very fun to do. They learn goal setting, they learn intensity levels, and teamwork, all the things that we kind of stress in PE and also um, work on with the five components of health related fitness. Um, it was really different because usually we just have like a ball or a frisbee and then we throw it around, but with the herbs it, it was um, a much bigger thing and everybody had their own. And so I thought it was probably the best PE thing I've done so far. And it made me feel good about myself because I was actually doing something active. So we learned about goal setting and how it should be possible, not like impossible goals. Mm -hmm. And we also learned about our intensity level and how hard we're breathing and what numbers one through five. And also we learned that we should keep trying, like keep going through the whole thing, and we shouldn't stop like halfway. Um, my favorite part of Urged was the relay race. Even though it was the most challenging, it, that's why it was fun because it was a challenge and it wasn't just something that you could do really easily. You had to work and you had to think about what to do. My favorite part was the competition part where we just had to roll for two minutes and see how far we could go. Well, I learned that um, rowing, it's not about how fast you um, row, it's about how much power you put into the stroke. Abs I definitely think that our ed gives a foundation for kids to go out um, and check into the different rowing programs throughout Seattle. Um, for example, one of my students, the first day, um, was learning how to row and loved it and got her mother and they drove down that afternoon to check out the program. It's, you're not just seeing how far you go in a little box, you're actually seeing how far you go by the change of the landscape. And I think it would also be fun because there's a lot more people in the boat and so you can go a lot faster. There are probably a lot of kids um, playing during the summertime or down at the beach or down at the water um, and they see these boats go by with a bunch of people in it rowing um, and then they come to school and then all of a sudden they have this erg ed program and it connects them of going hey that's something they were doing out on the water and that looks so fun now I get to bring it right into my classroom and in the gym and be able to do it. But just in case no one ever told you, I'ma tell you. After school, I go and change into my rowing stuff, and then I wait for Carla or Lindsay to pick me up, and then 
we go pick up other kids who also row and then we go to rowing practice. What I've learned from rowing is it's not easy to do things on your own. It's good to have teamwork and put it together and have everyone there to help you and you have someone who's encouraging you to do this instead of doing it on your own. You don't have to do it on your own. So what I've learned from rowing is that, just that teamwork is what you need. When I first started rowing, I was in eighth grade and I was coming in, I didn't know anybody. And it was kind of weird, but after, after a while, I met a bunch of people. I met Ollie and Melody, as you guys probably already met them, but, but it was cool. I mean, I've gotten taller and stronger just by doing it for novice season. And varsity are supposed to be twice as hard, so. Since I started rowing, I've been surprised by how encouraging I can be because usually I'm kind of like, why would I say go this person if I'm the one who wants to win? I'm the one who wants to like shine and be better, but it's really a team sport because if you're the only one who's doing better and you're not encouraging the rest of your team, then you're just gonna be by yourself. It's definitely given me a different mindset on my physical body and appearance and normally I wouldn't have exercise after school during break but knowing I have crew the next week, I prepare myself, I'll go on a jog or I'll eat healthier so just the mindset of knowing I have crew has definitely helped and changed my physical appearance because of that. In a future summer camp last summer, I was amazed at the passion and the dedication, not only of the staff, but of the rowers. And I am so inspired from Row to the Future that if I could replicate programs like this all across America, I will.